Welcome to BioLegend's Multicolor Panel Selector Tutorial. In this tutorial, you will learn how to construct and optimize a multicolor panel for your flow cytometry experiments. From any page on BioLegend's website, you can mouse over the Web Tools tab. From here, select the icon for the multicolor panel selector. Before beginning, we highly recommend that you review the instructions for use, as well as the guidelines for constructing an optimized panel. Click on the sections to expand the details. Once you have read these, you can start to create your panel. The selector has three categories for input, format or laser, reactivity, and specificity. You can turn on and off lasers based on the specifications of your instrument. Or if you don't want to use a certain floor for, you can individually turn on or off any formats. If you leave all the entries blank, the selector will default to giving you results for all of the formats. Next, select your reactivity or the type of sample you will be analyzing. Then type in your specificities. In this field, as you type, a window will pop up displaying the matching specificities in our catalog. You are required to select an item from this window, otherwise it may not match products correctly. To help you, the window will display synonyms for specificities as you mouse over each item. Click to select your desired item. Enter up to 12 specificities. If you need more than 12 specificities, just open a second window and follow the same procedure. In this example, I'm constructing a panel for T rings. When you are ready, Click Find Products. The spinning wheel indicates that your products are being searched. The reset button here will clear all of your information if you're ready to do a new search. The results return a matrix display of all your specificities and the formats available for each. We also provide the brightness index for each fluorophore to help optimize your panel. There's also a floor for information grouped by lasers. Just click on the emission button to access this information. In the window, you can find emission spectra, brightness index values, excitation and emission maximums, and general comments on each floor for. Now let's start adding products to our panel. We would recommend starting with the specificity with the least formats available. This makes panel selection much easier as you get to the end, you will have more options. In this case, CD73 has the least formats available, so let's choose a format for CD73 first. Let's choose PE. Click on the plus symbol to open a new window to show available products. To help you choose products, you can preview the product data sheet. Select the product you want to add by clicking the Add to Panel button. Your selection will now appear in the Panel Items section down below. Once you have a product selected, the column for that specificity and the format will be grayed out to indicate that these have already been chosen. If for some reason you do wish to select another format of the same specificity or a different specificity with the same format, you can do that, just select the grayed icon, but warnings will appear to alert you that the same format or specificity has already been chosen. Continue through with all the other specificities until you have completed your panel. Be sure to select your brightest fluorophores such as Brilliant Violet, 421, PE, and APC for your most weakly expressed antigens. And that way you can reserve the more dim fluorophores for your more highly expressed antigens. In the Panel Items section, you can remove any items from the panel with the red Remove icon. You can also preview data for each item by clicking on the Preview button on the left hand side. To put the panel items into your shopping cart, click the Add Panel to Shopping Cart button. From here you can print the panel, clear your shopping cart, clear your panel items, or check out. You can also choose to add an isotype control to your cart using the isotype control button. Thank you for viewing our multicolor panel selector tutorial. 
check out our other web tools for more useful information.